Hi, my name is Daisy Cagle, and I'm going to be doing my genetics video 5 on DNA fingerprinting. So we're going to be investigating the murder of deer, and our suspects are red wolf, gray wolf, coyote, and grizzly bear. And we're going to examine some VNTR locuses to determine which one of these predators killed the deer based on a hair left at the crime scene. Here are the two VNTR locusts for the evidence at the crime scene. We have the evidence hair found at the crime scene, victim, and the four suspects. So we're going to determine which one of the suspects or the victim left the hair. And we do that by matching up the evidence locuses with one has to have both of them. So we can see that in this locus, these three share one. And then these two share one, but the, all three of these don't match both of them, but grizzly bear matches both of them. And here we can see that red wolf and gray wolf both share one allele at the locus. We'll talk more about that in a second. So at VNTR locus two, here is the evidence left at the crime scene. We see that these three share one, but only one of them, grizzly bear, shares both of them, meaning that grizzly left the hair. But we're also going to talk about how red wolf is the biological parent of gray wolf because they both share one allele at each locus which is what um, you share with your parents. You have one allele from one parent and one allele for another parent at each locus. So this would be consistent with the fact that Red Wolf is Gray Wolf's parent. And here are my resources. Thank you.